cast your cares on the Lord and He will sustain you. Just because you have many failures and incompetency, but you are no less worthy of love. Know this, that the Lord loves you the same. The safest place in this world is still in the arms of the Almighty God. He loves you. He holds you dear to His heart. When you put God first, you know for sure that you will always win. Jesus will bless you and He will bless you much more than you deserve. When you see battles in your life, unseen battles, go to God in prayer. For prayer is the best weapon to win your battles. The Holy Spirit that is already in you will give you the ability to overcome anything. There is power in this spirit that is living in you. So walk in the power of this spirit. Jesus did not die to give you a religion. Christianity is not a religion. Jesus died so that through faith in Him, you could have an intimate relationship with God. Never allow the pain of your past to speak louder than the promises of God for your future. You are a new creation. You have a new life in Christ. Trust God and He will show you how to move forward. Put Him at the center of everything center of your life, center of your work, center of your home. When you look back over the years, you will come to this conclusion that the best decision that you have ever made is by giving your life to Jesus Christ. The God who protected Daniel from the lions in the den is the same God who will protect you and your family. For our God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Every single time you see your life as half empty or empty, know this, God has filled it exactly what you need. Recognize God at work in your life. He has said it over and over again, clearly written in His word. Trust Him. Trust God. Not once in the Bible does it say, worry about it, stress over it, figure it out your own. When you go through storms in your life, winds that is too big, waves that is too strong, listen to his whisper, fear not, I am with you. Put this God above your storm, above every diseases, Above every concerns in your life, call upon His name, for the name of the Lord is great. He wants you to stop worrying and trust that He is working in your life. Stress comes from trying to do it all on your own, but peace comes when you put all things in God's hands. People change and so is the world. God does not change. He is the eternal one, the same yesterday, today, and forever. Therefore, we do not know what holds tomorrow, but we can completely trust the one that holds tomorrow, our Lord Jesus Christ. Continue to trust Him. He will not fail you. He never will. When you believe in God and know that He is sovereign, He is in charge you will have peace. You may not see a way, but God has already made a way for you. So stand firm in your faith. Watch God working on your behalf. Today, 
Choose to worship Him over worrying about your situation. Choose to believe in Him over fearing for your future. Choose the peace that God can give you over panicking. For God is powerful, all-knowing, all-capable, all-sovereign. He gives you His saving grace. When God is in you, you have enough. You will be greatly blessed. You will be greatly favoured. You will be deeply loved. For God who has created you, see you as beautiful. He wants to take care of you. You will be saved. You will not be alone. When God is with you, you will see things differently. You will glow. You will have grace shown. Trust God with whatever that is weighing you heavy on your mind. Don't let anxiety rule your life. Leave worry behind. God is not punishing you. He is preparing you. Trust His plan. Empty what is bothering you and let God fill you. You may be going through a difficult season. Your year hasn't been easy. But take joy. Your obedience has been strong. Your faith in God hasn't failed you. God is planning something for you. He has been with you all along. So talk to God at all times, whether it is in the morning, afternoon or night, even middle of the night. Know this, the mountains that you are facing, you could be a sign there to show others that your mountains can be moved when God is with you. May God bless you richly. Turn your eyes upon Jesus. Look full in His wonderful face. And the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of His glory and grace.